This is chapter five, number two. You're gonna solve each inequality, then solve. Here we have x is uh, minus seven, which is going to be um, less than negative five. So we're gonna add seven to both sides here. Okay. This cancels, leaving you with an x the symbol and this is a two so here this is the less than so this is x is less than two so all we need is zero and we need the value of two here this is going to be open and we want values of x which is less than two so it goes all the way here right all the way here to the right okay these are all the values that are less than Two. Here we go for this one. We have 10, it is greater than or equal to x minus four. So we're gonna add four to both sides. So this cancels, leaving you with a 14 is greater than or equal to x. So we just need zero and then we can put like 14 here. We can close it right here because of the bar. And this is the greater than and equal to, okay? So we go all the way to the right, okay? Those are all the values that are greater than 14. Here we go, two X is less than 18, so we're gonna divide two to both sides, this cancels, leaving you with an X is less than nine, so we just need zero and nine. Here we open it. We want values of x that is less than nine. So our values all the way to the left. Our values of x that are less than nine. Here we go for this one. We have negative 10, it is greater than or equal to five x. We're gonna divide by five to both sides. This cancels, just leaving you with just an x greater than or equal to, this is negative two. We don't like it this way. We rather have it like this, where X is in front of the negative two. And make sure we flip the inequality when we write it, when we flip it. So this is X is less than or equal to negative two. So here's zero, here's negative two. We close it right here and we want values of X, which is less than negative two. So these are the values to the left. It is negative two, okay? All right, there you go. That is how you solve, then solve for each of the inequalities.